What's up guys, Evil Deer here, the most ultimate YouTuber in the world. No, honestly, I'm actually quite shit because I just stopped doing films for a month. Spring break! <laughs> but I'm here to clarify that. About a month ago, I wrote up a little post on Patreon. I'm like, hi guys, I know you give me money, but I'm gonna disappear for a while because, you know, life got in the way. If you can avoid life, do that. Seriously, life's not worth it, just avoid it. Not by like killing yourself or some crazy shit like that. Seriously, if you got any type of that thinking, just contact me like privately and we'll sort that shit out. Life got in the way with me. So basically, I, I lost my job. I knew it was coming because my contract ended and then I went overseas and I spent lots of money and I had lots of fun. And then I was like, oh shit, I need money. So I had to go look for work and just focus on that for a while. And obviously, Esperanto don't pay, so I, I gotta focus on that. Something has to go. And then it was the YouTube channel. Evil Deer had to do, you know how like God had five like five days rest and no wait shit it would have been pretty bad god if you were five days rest one day work it's like just chill bros five days work one day rest well i had like two years work and then one month rest um the next thing is you probably notice that i'm speaking freaking english right now i don't know why i'm just picking this grass and like take this camera <laughs> oh, you won't mess with me again yeah i'm speaking english now because my life is changing direction and it's going to impact on my youtube channel right chill there i'm focused more on amikumu now amikumu is my like like soul focus and I'm putting all my life, my blood, my babies into a type of thing. And I know some people, I've seen posts like on Liberta Folio where people are like, ah, oh, Mikul, well that's like a waste of time, no one uses that. Fuck you mate, I'll fucking headbutt you. Even if others don't believe it's going to work out, I believe it is. It's taking off, it's starting to grow outside the Esperanto community. We've got some traction going finally now. If you have any fucking idea how hard it is to grow a social network? But anyway, we're working on it and it's growing and I want to put my heart into this thing. So in order to help it grow, I now need to start promoting it outside the Esperanto community. It's kind of hard to do that when you run an Esperanto YouTube channel. So I'm going to do a lot more videos in English and I'm going to do collabs with the local YouTube community here in English. Um, I'm going to like try and meet up with local organizations, businesses, I don't know, I'm probably just harassing people on the street but of course Esperanto still plays an important part in my life so it's going to be like more pushed down and like hidden in there and I'll be like blah 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 blah, blah Esperanto blah 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 and they'll be like oh what was that I'm basically now changing the main language of this channel over to English shit I know that sounds scary because people are gonna be like oh look at I'm not like disappearing from the Esperanto community I'm now focusing my energies on promoting something which I hope in the future will be able to actually grow the language in general if you want to just watch Esperanto videos totally get that Shit, my hair's all messed up. Totally get that. There's like 500 videos in Esperanto in this channel. If you've seen that entire backlog, shit man, you probably know more about me than my wife. But if you've seen that entire backlog, there's still other Esperanto YouTubers out there. The Esperanto Variety Show, that's also a very good YouTube channel in Esperanto. And the funny thing is like, all the YouTubers that I know of are like native English speakers. That's kind of interesting. Maybe it's like mainly in English phenomenon, phenomenon, phenomenon. Jesus, I can't even... How am I going to YouTube in this language when I can't even fucking speak it? If you got any concerns, obviously just jot them down in the, the comments below. And if I don't like them, I'm just going to do like a censorship scenario, you know, like fucking delete that shit. No, I won't do that. I'll probably just ignore you. But I'll try and like respond as much as I can. Now, I know, again, this is a big thing. I'm moving mainly from Esperanto to English. I believe it's for the good of the community because I need to promote Amikumu and it's so freaking hard with an Esperanto channel. Anyway, that's it. I'm just bubbling on and out, bubbling on blubbling on right now so if you've enjoyed this video like it share it around sub to the channel if you haven't already um abuse me in the comments because now i'm changing direction i'm using english which is i don't know some people see it as like the imperialistic language of the world serious side note i didn't learn esperanto because of any type of political motivations or idolism or anything like that i learned the language because i enjoy it and i enjoy the community and i can still take part in that anyway that's the end if you like this video share it around blah spring break bro yeah.